This video is going to show you how to make a graph in a Google Docs spreadsheet. To begin with, your data has got to appear in two columns. So you have time and light luminosity in two columns, and they have headers on them. So I'm going to highlight my two columns, and that will put that data in the graph. Then from the Insert menu up here, I'm going to select Chart. Charts down the menu down here. Now on this page, what I want to do is I'm going to click on the scatter option so I can get an XY graph. So I'll click on scatter, and then I've got all these different types of scatters over here, the subtypes. And I'm going to click on the one that looks like the line. So I won't see the points, it'll just show me the XY graph of what I'm looking for. And at the bottom part of the screen, I can see a preview of what the graph's going to look like. So on mine, what I'm going to do is it's got a legend. The legend is this piece of information over here on the side of the graph. Now I'm not going to have the legend, so I'm going to turn that off, so it says no legend. I'll give my chart a title up here, and then the horizontal axis I'll give some kind of title. Let's say it was time, and I'll put the units next to it. And the vertical axis was intensity, and I'll give its units over here as well. And I'm all set. I can also do a maximum and a minimum if I want to down here, so I can force it to show the zero or show some other point. Uh, maybe my data starts at a thousand. I don't want it to start at zero, so I can have it start at a thousand, or maybe I do want it to start at a thousand. So I have all those kind of options that I can fix there. Then I'll click on Save Chart at the bottom of the screen. So that's down here. And there's my chart. It's got a title to it. The legend is not shown, which is nice. If I go to the side, somewhere along this border, along this edge, I can adjust the width of my chart. So my cursor will change. I clicked on it. The cursor changed. I can hold down the shift key and adjust everything equally. So I can make it fit wherever I want to. And now that I've clicked on my chart, I've also got this little bar up here that I can slide it around and move it where I want it to be. Where it says chart, I can click on that. I can edit the chart, delete it, assign a script, um, save this image. So I can just save the image of the chart to put in another document and I can post it or I can move it to its own sheet. So if I want to make any changes I'll click on edit and when I click on edit I've got all these choices all over again. So I'm going to hit on cancel to get out of here. And that's how you make a simple XY graph in Google Docs.